This is vlog 493. Yeah, yeah, you need it's Ken. Good. Morning. What's up, baby? Uh, big, big news today. Giant news. Giant news. Enormous news. Should I let them know now? Wait for it. Wes, get on over here. Sorry, I was shooting a small Shutter car man. that's Shutter going man. by. Oh, we got, I got oh, a national one. Look at, look at that. That's awesome. Sorry. All right, track. We're at Wheels and Waves, but we have a very big announcement for Wheels and Waves. We're going to be leaving this venue, which is at Gladstone, so we're moving into downtown Malibu to the Country Mart as of January 21st. Downtown Malibu? Uh, downtown. No way. That's how we roll, baby. That is how we roll. wrong but that's okay january 15th is that right it's the 15th the january 15th sunday. that's sunday. the third sunday in january is the 15th that's when wheels and waves is going to start up again in downtown malibu at the country mart in front of malibu kitchen starbucks coffee bean all that stuff lots of coffee you guys awake and amazing cars no rain and no rain because ken said so turnout today but the clouds are spectacular this is the last time we'll be at Gladstones for wheels and waves there will be no show again for December but our new show is going to be spectacular And this is Hazel. I'm not going to switch that around because you would look weird as a Hazel. <laughs> We're at Wheels and Waves, and you have a, a very unusual Volkswagen. But I do. this is kind of what you do. This is what I do. All right, so tell me about it. What, tell me about the car and then tell me about the business. The car is a 1969 uh, VW Beetle. It's The full suspension's been gone through front and rear. It's got disc brakes all the way around. It's been lowered out. Uh, there's absolutely no interior in the car. It's been completely stripped. Uh, it looks no, like a track car. It, it is. It is. It's been on pretty much every track uh, up north. It was a chump car racer for three years. Uh, it did lemons uh, twice. Uh, yeah, it's, it's the it's, ultimate show. Absolutely. It was. It's been fun. So okay. why uh, why this car? Well, you know why this why Volkswagen's for you? I got bit uh, about 14 years ago by my first Volkswagen, and ever since then it's just been you know one step after the next. And I, I love it. It's great. They're they're air cooled. Uh, it's one of the only cars you can pull out of somebody's backyard and start right up with some gasoline and a, yeah. and a you easy know. to fix. Exactly. Easy to do things on. Is, is this your thing? Do you like these cars? Oh yeah. I have the red 69. Is, is that is that why you hang out with this guy? Oh yeah. <laughs> no. Wait. What car did you bring in? This red. Okay. The one over there. Yeah. Is that all original? Yeah. 
Kids from five years old all the way up to the old guys that are 90, 85, 90 years old. Oh, yeah. These guys are all looking out the windows, giving me the thumbs up. Kids got their faces against the window looking at it's the cars. A, it's a smiling car. It, it, it yeah. is. It, it is. It makes people feel good. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, I appreciate you guys coming. And then you have a business having to do with this. I do. Audi Customs. And so if you have a Volkswagen and you, need, you want some cool stuff done on it, how, how would these people get in touch with you? I'll then get a hold of me on uh, Facebook through Walker Farnsworth. Also, uh, we're, we're Drivers Wanted out of uh, uh, Porter Ranch. That's the club. Yeah, absolutely, that okay. is our club. All right, Volkswagen, super love. Ouch, another example of why to drive slow on PCH. Just saying. Today, I'm gonna try to build something. Out in front of our house, we have had our uh, mailboxes across the street, and they've been slowly falling apart over the last 20 years, my mailbox as well as our neighbors. So I'm gonna build something that's uh, uh, not gonna fall apart. So it's gonna take a little while to do that, but that's kind of what I'm working on today. That's the extent of our mailboxes. It's all fallen over. I'm gonna put something new right here. You rang? Yeah, you just try the song for me. Oh, joy. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Hello. Hello. All right, I'm walking up in town, letting all the businesses know that we're doing Wheels and Waves at the Country Mart. And right in the middle of doing that, I spot one of these. They're everywhere. What can I say? That's the whole reason we want to do a Carson Coffee. exciting stuff. I am super stoked to be able to to bring to you guys a, a more refined, a more expansive, a 
just a cooler freaking show. Bills and Waves at the Malibu Country Mart is going to be so cool. I'm so grateful to Cost Financial who, who gave me the big thumbs up and said, hey, let's do this thing. I spent the, the last couple of hours walking around town, talking to people, and they pretty much already knew that it was happening. And it just proves that the more that you give love to things, the, the bigger they get, the more expensive they get, the cooler things get. And that brings me, once again, back. This is something uh, that is, is life-changing. It's something that if you guys will, will step onto this train with me, will get on board and get excited about your life and the, and the things that you have and the coolness that's going on in your life right now, however small, we can help each other to expand and make our lives better. And it's this simple idea, and that is that what you focus on is what you get. All you have to do is be grateful for the things that you have. I, I have several friends, uh, people in my life that, that are having fun, uh, having health challenges. They got a little bit of this going on, they got a little bit of that going on, they got a little bit of something going on. Kind of complain about those things. They don't tell me that they're working hard to make things better. No, I'm not trying to judge them. That's in the, the frame of reference that they're in. That's what's in their mindset. They see this thing, it hurts, and then they, they talk about it. But what they don't realize is that they are, they are keeping the flow of that negativity going. They're keeping that problem there by acknowledging that problem instead of focusing on health. You can't get better if you're focusing on the problem. You have to focus on the solution. You have to focus on health. You have to be grateful for the things that are working in your life. And the more that you can do that, the better things get. Appreciation is a secret of success. The more that you appreciate the things in your life, whether it's health, finance, uh, your family, whatever it is, the more that you can express appreciation, the more that those things you're appreciating will expand and grow and get better. Big stacks of cash everywhere. You don't know what to do. You got to, you, it's just falling on you. It's like rain and dough. Not only will your health get better, but it'll be so good that you, you'll be running marathons. You'll be doing things you can't even believe that you're doing. If you appreciate people and relationships, those relationships are going to expand and grow and suddenly you're going to find the love of your life. Or you're going to find the... Uh, things are just going to get better. You have to see one point. You got to focus. You got to stay straight to the course. You got to get on the cool train. So stick with me on the blog. Hang out. Check out the blogstagrams that we do. Check out all the positive stuff that we try to reinforce. And just have fun. Look at your life as being a, a blessing because that's what it is. You're here. You get to watch me. I get to hang out with you guys and we get to do cool stuff. And that's Block 493. Bam! That's how we roll, people. Oh!